Listen to the 48 Hours podcast for shocking murder cases and compelling real life dramas from one of television's most watched true crime shows. Go behind the scenes of each episode with award winning CBS News correspondents and producers in Post Mortem, a weekly deep dive. Listen to 48 Hours wherever you get your podcasts. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of the T-Moss Boss Show. And in today's episode, um, I don't know what to really call this episode. I don't know whether to call it just, you know, what's on my mind or uh, a serious episode. I mean, it, it can be, I don't know. I don't know what to call it. I, I honestly, at the end of the day, I don't know. I can't even give you all an answer on what to call it and stuff, but... No, what I overall wanted to talk on uh, was my goal this year for 2022 because um, here's the thing. Past few years, I I would have to say I've been distracted um, a lot, you know, with uh, just more so like, yeah, focusing on my love life. And I think I've said that before, you know, like you're trying to focus on building your business and focus on the love life like some can do, and I'm not going to say that it's impossible. I just feel like for me, in I don't know, like for me, I feel like that it's not impossible, but at the same time, um, it, it's, it's just not possible right now. Like, if that makes sense. Like, I've tried, and it just seems like that it's always a situation where, you know, I'm turned down. Or, you know, I don't pursue after or I, you know, it's it's just always something. And I just feel like that it's, you know, not to sound rude, but at the, you know, it's a waste of time, you know, like trying to chase after something and um, overall, like nothing happens. So I'm like, I, you know, I, I just can't overall, you know, go through that no more. And it's like, yeah, you know heartbreaks and all this other extra crap so that's why i'm like yeah this year 2022 i'm i'm uh more so gonna uh focus on myself you know focus on content creating focus uh yeah just on all of that because i do feel like that uh like you know when i like when i had overall stopped focusing on the hate it took a big, like, weight off of me, you know, like, when I stopped making videos on these guys every day, had to, you know, stop thinking, like, oh, I'm, you know, I gotta constantly defend myself, or I gotta, you know, like, I, you know, I, like, I don't, I didn't need to do any of that stuff in the first place, and, um, I'm, yeah, I, it's, it's pretty much, like, my old version of, like, WWE budget cuts and stuff, like, but, no, nah, these, these are things that I need to cut out of my life, because it, uh, you know, it's weighing down on me, and I feel like, you know, having this weight lifted up off of me, um, yeah, I feel like that I can accomplish a lot, I feel like I could get a lot done, you know, when I am sitting down, taking the time to focus on myself, um, because I'll have my moments when I am, and I'm not thinking about nothing, bruh, y'all should see me some days, because when there's days where I'm just sitting down, focusing on myself, focusing on content, like, I had just worked on some vlogs that I've recorded, like, last year, bruh, I, I sat there, and it was on top of that, like, it was, like, a dozen, um, of other videos I had, and I worked on podcast episodes, I'm saying, like, I'll take the time to focus on myself and I get so much done. So that's why I'm like, nah, you know, I need to be that, but like 24 seven, because, um, overall, like to give you guys, uh, advice on that stuff, you know, cause I, I, yeah, I, I overall have to say like, you know, with, uh, having like trying to focus on the love life and then nothing's not happening. That's hard on you. Like that, that's hard. Like for those that don't go through that, like you don't care about that. Um, and that's the thing where I'm like, I'm not trying to assume, uh, how people think and how they are, but I do feel like that it's something that crosses, um, a person's mind. Now me, it crosses my mind one too many times, you know, like, and I, I just, I've gotten to the point in time in my life where I'm like, look, I like, I know I'm doing my part and I know I will always do my part. But I need to know, like, if something is possible. 
Because if not, then yeah, I've just gotten to the point in time where I'm like, I'm not going to pursue. I'm not going to chase. I'm not going to, you know, send all lovely messages and be all like, you know, this nice and caring guy. Like, nah, I'm like, I'm, I'm just going to focus on myself. Like, I, I am going to be nice and caring, but I am going to uh, take the time to focus on myself because it's, you know, it, it's hard, man. It's hard having, like, that, you know, that mindset. So that's why I'm like, I can't, you know, I can't go through that, like, time after time, day after day. Like, it's hard. It, it's extremely, extremely hard. So, yeah, that's why I'm, you know, it's uh just overall, like, you know, like I was saying, giving y'all advice on that. Like, how do you uh, avoid that mindset? And yeah, like what I've been saying, like, you know, take it in time to uh, focus on yourself. Like, don't focus on, you know, something that's uh, overall, like, you know, like weighing down on you and it's weighing down on you in a negative way. You know, like, nah, like sit down, re- you know, well, I mean, like talking like from my perspective, like, yeah, record videos, record podcast episodes, stream for it hours on end. Find new games to play, you know, like, uh, go outside, exercise, like, that's just the stuff that gets me through the day, you know, going outside, exercising, you know, doing whatever, but the whole, like, you know, like, I'm got to sit around and be sad, I'm so sick and tired of that, I'm so sick and tired of sitting around being sad, like, that's why I didn't really want to record this episode, because it came off as, like, a sad episode, And I'm like, I don't want it to be that. I'm tired of doing like the sad podcast episodes. I feel like I did one too many sad podcast episodes. I'm like, nah, there ain't even a reason to be sad. Like, that's the thing about it. I'm like, I'm I'm out here being sad over something that that never was going to happen in the first place. So why am I sad? You know, and I'm like, I'm I'm tired of that. You know, I'm I'm just I'm so tired of it. And I'm like, bro, it's at a point in time where I'm like, I got to just move on. And take the time to focus on myself, because I have to say, like, I think probably, yeah, probably throughout my whole um, duration of my content creating a career, well, well, I mean, yeah, I guess, like, yeah, throughout the whole duration of my content creating career, because I started in high school, so I had no choice but to focus, you know, on high school and stuff, like, I, I, you know, I, that wasn't on slide with my family, like, me quitting high school so I could be a full-time content creator, but during that time, though, I did go through, you know, some uh, traumatic stuff. And then it, like, led into my content, you know, creating career. So constantly, I'm, like, you know, sad, holding myself back, sitting there, you know, just, yeah, not, like, taking the time to, you know, focus on stuff. But even when it was just the school thing that was weighing me down, I still wasn't, like, you know, giving content creating um, a whole lot of, like, you know, time, like, I give it, like, maybe a little bit of time, record a video, like, what, maybe every three to six months, after that, I'm good, and I'm, like, it shouldn't even have been that in the first place, you know, like, I should have, like, my thing is this, I do get mad at myself at times, because I didn't take things, like, serious enough, you know, like, I was just sitting around, like, slacking, and just not, you know, yeah, overall not being serious, and I should have been serious more, but, you know, like, at this point in time, I'm like, hey, look, like, I've crossed that bridge, now it's time to, you know, cross this other bridge, and that's just focusing on who I am today, and focusing on, you know, bettering uh, my situation, like, now and stuff, because if I don't, then yeah, this this it's just gonna be a constant, you know, re- like, not reminder, but just a constant cycle of, like, letting so many different, like, opportunities, like, go with content creating and stuff, so that's why I'm like, nah, I I gotta just sit down and, uh, yeah, overall, just, you know, take the time to get that mindset of where I am, uh, focusing on myself, but, yeah, I'm like, I can't, you know, I can't do this every day, like, I, I can't be this person every day, like, you guys should see me, like, uh, like, now versus how I was, like, a couple of years ago, a couple of years ago, oh, I wouldn't have mind, like, laying in bed all day, you know, not doing nothing, but, I see that now, and I'm like, nah, man, I'm like, I can't do that, like, I get, I get so frustrated and mad at doing that and stuff, and I know most people are just like, well, just get out of bed thing, like, it's, it's not that hard, just get out of bed, and it's like, nah, it's like, you don't understand how depression works, when you're depressed, you don't want to get out of bed, you know, you don't want to record videos, you don't want to stream, you don't want to, you know, 
do your job like do do what you're you know was like what you were meant to do and stuff and yeah it's you know that's why like when i look at a lot of situations like when i look at you know and i, and I guess like this is where the seriousness like comes in but when i look at people like uh robin williams and seeing how much that man entertained. And I'm not saying, like, that's the situation with me. You know, I'm just saying, like, you know, just talking on it and stuff. But, um, but no, when I look at his situation, I don't want to end up in his situation. Like, that's the thing where it's like, yeah, I know it's messed up saying that. Like, Robin Williams is um, one of the most, like, creative and entertaining people to ever walk the face of this earth. But... To be in a situation where you are, and I would assume, like, yeah, he was, like, very, very depressed. But to be in that mindset where you are that depressed and you end up doing, like, what he did, I don't ever want to be that person. And that's the thing where I'm, like, I'm I'm avoiding on being that person because I feel like, like, at some points in time in my life, I was aiming to be in his same situation. And I'm, like, I can't do that. You know, I just, I don't want to end up like that. I don't want to do that. That's the one thing in life where I'm like, I am avoiding it at all costs. You know, and if that is what takes me out of this world, is avoiding that one thing, hey, so be it. My thing is this. I want to, and you know what, I was like sitting down thinking about this. Like, you know, if I live my whole life and I don't get what I want, you know, I don't get the wife, I don't get the kids, you know, I don't get the fancy house or the fancy cars i just get what you know is meant for me i'm like hey i've i've gotten to the point where i'm like somewhat accepting towards it you know like because i still crave it i still want that you know and i am still young so that's why i'm like hey you know what um i really don't know what the future holds for me and i don't really know what's gonna you know happen in the future but if that's my life if that's what how you know like i grow old and I look back and I'm like, hey, you know what? I was hard at, you know, I was like working hard at what I was doing. You know, I didn't give up. I still kept chasing my dreams. I still kept chasing my goals. I'm not like, this ain't like me saying that I'm giving up. It's just me saying like, I'm going to be more accepting of my situations. And overall, like, you know, still just take the time to focus on myself. And, um... Yeah, you know, like I was saying, like, if I don't get what I want, then I don't get what I want. I'm going to have to live with that, you know. Because I feel like a lot of people don't understand, you know, like, the whole meaning of life. Like, sometimes, like, that stuff, you know, ain't meant for people. And I'm not, like, you know, trying to, like, deny my blessings or any of that stuff. Like, whatever my blessings are, I welcome it. I want it. I wish I could have all my blessings now, you know. But it's probably a thing where it's like, you know, I just got to be patient. Got to take time. And uh, overall, like at some at some point in time, yeah, my blessings will uh, overall show up. But I'm like, I'm wanting all this stuff now. And I'm like, it ain't meant for me to have it now. You know, the relationship, wife, kids, house, fancy car, fancy this, fancy that. It ain't meant for me to have that stuff now. You know, so I'm like, if, if that's if that's the case, then that's the case. You know, I, I can't be mad about it. You know, I just got to accept it. Like, that's God's plan and that's God's plan. I can't be mad about it, you know, so... That's why I'm like, I've just gotten to a point in time where I'm like, hey, you know what? Like, I'm, you know, I'm still going, you know, do my thing regardless. Like, that's that's something that's never going to change is me doing my thing. Because that's like, honestly, though, like what I was overall saying, like, you know, like with taking myself like, you know, even more serious this year. Fam, that, you know, all I'm pretty much, it was, I'm actually trying to say more content. You know, like more content and it's more content like for, you know, I feel like this year it has to be dedicated to impressing myself. I feel like, you know, past few years, I'm trying to impress everybody else. At the end of the day, I need to impress myself. You know, I need to show myself what I'm capable of because I feel like once when I see what I'm capable of, then the world will see what I'm capable of. You know, and that's just that motivation I want to put in everybody's hearts. It's like, you know, have that motivation in you where you get like, you're like, whoa, wow, I didn't even know I was capable of doing all of that, you know, and I, and I feel like I'm like, with me, I'm like, I gotta do more, you know, like, that's what I'm, like, that's overall, like, you know, what I just gotta see for myself is that I got to do more, so no more distractions, you know, like, no more of this, like, love life stuff, like, all of that, I just gotta focus on myself now, you know, and make the best of my situations now, 
be happy, enjoy life, enjoy, I, I can't say it's sunny outside, and so I can't be like, oh, enjoy the sun, it, I live in Washington State, it's raining, so <laughs> I gotta enjoy the rain, I gotta go outside and enjoy the rain and stuff, I gotta just, you know, and enjoy, like, my current life situation, because there's, my thing is this, there's people out there that wanted what I, you know, have, and they, you know, they're not even here with us today, so that's why I'm like, hey, you know what, I gotta just enjoy, like, you know, life and what it is right now and make the best out of it. So, yeah, just overall letting people know, like, if you do see a lot of content from me this year, I have my reasons, all right? But anyways, and that being said, I will talk to y'all later. Thank you to everybody that tuned into today's episode. I'm not gonna, you know, do no promos and stuff because I do feel like, in a way, that this was a serious episode. And I think that's why, because that's why I didn't really know what to title this episode because I'm like, it ain't that serious, but at the same time, like, you know, I don't want to do the promo. So, but anyways, um, yeah, talk to y'all later. Thank you, guys, and peace.